Hey guys, what is going on? It is your boy Solitrip here, back with another video. In today's video, guys, I have got a kills and deaths counter where I will add one to a scoreboard called kills whenever someone gets a kill. And that person that died will have one added to their deaths counter. This is also compatible with my leaderboard system that is on the top right now. If you guys want to click on that, you can see my leaderboard system. It's compatible with that. But let me show you how this works. So the way that this works, if we have a JK here and we have deaths on the scoreboard, when JK dies, as you can see, it goes to four deaths. Now, if we go and change this to kills, we can see I have 38 kills. And when I kill JK, you can see that now I have 39. So that is how the scoreboard for kills and deaths works. Now let's add this to your world. So guys, the first thing that you want to do is go to my GitHub down below, and then you guys want to go to my kills and deaths counter folder right here. When you click on it, you'll be greeted with an index.js file. You guys want to click on that. And then this is the kills and deaths script that you guys want to copy. Then you want to open up Visual Studio Code, and you guys want to go to your manifest.json, and you guys want to find your entry file. My entry file is scripts forward slash main.js. So let's go to that. Once we've got this open, make sure you know where this is. Then we're going to go to our scripts folder. We're going to right click that and we're going to click on new folder. From there, we're simply just going to type kills and deaths or whatever you guys want to call it. I'm just going to call mine kills and deaths. Then we're going to click on new file and you're going to type index.js and we're going to enter that. Then you guys are going to paste in the script just like that. Then what you guys want to do is go back to your main.js. Then inside here, you guys want to type import base and then in quotation marks, you guys want to put a full stop forward slash and then the folder that you put your kills and deaths index.js in and a forward slash index.js and you guys want to save that. Then when you go back to Minecraft, simply do a reload and if you get main.js has loaded, that is now ready. Your script will be working, but now guys, what you need to do is go to scoreboard, go to objectives, type add, Make sure you add a deaths scoreboard with a capital D and then press enter. I've already got one created. And then you also want to do this for kills as well. As you guys can see, scoreboard objective add kills dummy and press enter. Now, guys, from there, the script should be working super, super simple. I've got a little description inside of the script as well. If you guys want to learn a little bit more about how all of this works. So that's it for today's video, super simple. And this was requested by this person on screen. Like I said, guys, I will do videos that you guys request in the comments down below. So please do let me know what you guys want to see. And I will be releasing another video on Sunday, every single Sunday at 6 p.m. UK time. But anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. It's been your boy Solus. Don't forget to like the video if this has helped you. Subscribe if you haven't already. It's free to do and helps out the channel a lot. And I will catch you guys in the next one. It's me, Boy Solus. Peace.